Hey guys, Della 304 here. Today we're going to be making a little overview on the Power Mac G4 desktop. I got this computer from my friend for free. He actually, I can't remember where he acquired it from, but basically he got it running and he gave it to me because he didn't really have a use for it, I guess. And he knows that I am a grade A computer collector. <laughs> This thing is fully functional, although it is a little ghetto rigged because the original power supply died in it. So my friend, Chris, ghetto rigged a regular ATX power supply and made it work in this machine. I'm going to attempt to open up the case and show you guys how that works. It's, it's pretty ghetto and getting it to fit together isn't the easiest thing in the world. So I'm going to try to open the case without, without messing it up. So here is the inside of the machine. As you can see, we have a full-size ATX power supply in here. I have used a mouse that I had <laughs> and a spare heatsink to kind of prop this up to give clearance for the video card, which I believe is an ATI Radeon 9000. We have this random fan, which actually sits on top of the video card once I close the system. It attempts to bring exhaust out of the system through the back so it doesn't overheat. Speaking of that, I believe this thing has dual 1.25 GHz PowerPC G4s. I believe it has at least 1.5 gigs of RAM. It might have two, I forget. It has a 200 GB Hitachi Desk Star, if I'm not mistaken, from 2003, probably the original drive. And like I said, the Radeon 9000. So there you are. There is a quick inside view of the computer. Let's go ahead and close it up and boot it up. So let's go ahead and power it on. Loudspeaker. <laughs> Will we have video? That is the question. Well, I don't know why, but it took a little finagling for it to get to for it to display any video, but there we are. It's running Mac OS 10.4 point something, I forget, but clock battery is ridiculous, or, you know, used up, so it thinks it's 1969 for some reason. So there we are. There are the specs. I was right. Dual 1.25 GHz G4s, 2 MB of L3 cache per processor, 2 GB of DDRSD RAM, and 10.4.11. So there you are. While it is quite ghetto, it does indeed function. So, you know, there's not much I can do. It does, it doesn't, it used to have OS 9 on it, but it doesn't anymore. I can't remember why. I think I removed it. Not sure. But as you can see, if I can open this, it has 200 gigs. That's, that only says 171 because there's a second partition. But there you are. Not much else I can show you. There's nothing on this machine. So there you go. There is a little overview on the Power Mac G4.